Let's write a C program to subtract one number from the other without using minus symbol. We will be using bitwise complement operator here. So I'll ask the user to enter two numbers and store it inside the address of variables A and B. Well, these types of questions are asked in your vivas, interviews, and maybe in your exams, tricky questions. So pay attention. So sub, that is result is equal to, I'll show you this tilde operator preceding B. It's called one's complement. I'll show you the result. That is sub. The result will be present inside sub. So I have asked the user to enter two numbers. So I'll give four and second number as 10. We operate on this number that is second number that is B. So 10, one's complement of 10 is minus 11. Let's check that. Yes, one's complement of 10 is minus 11. So let's, uh, let's arrive at two's complement that is sub plus one. This is two's complement. Let's check that too. I'll compile this and execute. So I'll give five and 10 again. So two's complement of 10 is minus 10. It's two's complement, not one's complement. So, okay, let me show you once again, five and 10. So two's complement of 10 is minus 10. Okay, so let's subtract the two numbers. Sub is equal to A plus this one, that is two's complement, sub plus one. So I'll sub, uh, substitute the sub value, that is tilde symbol and B. So let me remove these things. So I have not used subtraction, that is minus operator here. So subtraction of percentage D and percentage D is percentage D, A comma B comma sub. Let's check that. I'll give five and 10, it should give five. So 10 minus five is five. Let's try that once again. I'll give five minus 10. It should give minus five, okay? It's working. Let me give five and five. So it should return zero, right? Five minus five. It should be zero. Okay, it's working. Let's try one more thing. Five and minus five. It should give five and minus five. It should give 10. Five minus of minus five is 10. So that's working. Please visit the link present in the description section of this YouTube video for source code, notes and discussion about this topic. Stay subscribed to our YouTube channel and blog. Share this video with your friends online and please do not forget to like this video on YouTube. Thank you.